Yeah, Jeff, I just want to push back against something you said, not because I think you're wrong, but I want you to clarify it. You point out that it would be impossible for retail investors to force a, a squeeze in something like silver and the differences between cornering a commodity versus squeezing a stock. Um, but I remember 10 years ago, there was a moment when GLD, the gold ETF, had more assets in it in dollar terms than the SPY. And I do think that GLD was moving the price of gold. I, c I can imagine a similar situation um, with, with silver and the silver ETF if people get excited enough about it where what happens in the markets ends up influencing what happens with the actual metal in real life. You're saying you don't think that that's a possibility? I mean, you're talking 900 million ounces in the ETF versus a 25 billion ounce market. And by the way, the, the, but the those billion market, ounces don't move. The, but the the silver market. They just is, sit. And then you, go on. They just but sit. Think, those other ounces just sit. They don't move. Right, but the vast. I mean, you look at the flows going in and out of these ETFs. They're not that big. But but I guess my question is: forget the ETF. Um, in terms of thinking about how are you going to create a squeeze, the shorts are the ETFs. The ETFs buy the physical, they turn around and they sell on the COMEX to be able to hedge that physical position like any other corporate. It's right. not a naked short like in an equity. But here's the main reason why I don't think it's possible to squeeze one of these markets uh, like what the Hunt brothers did in 1980. You got position limits in these markets and they've gotten tighter and tighter. There's seven and a half million ounces right now, um, which means that if you were to squeeze it, you would have to divvy up the position to get the inventory off the exchange 53 times, which each position worth $217 million, and then do it in a coordinated fashion. Mm -hmm. That's why I say it's incredibly unlikely. Yeah. We'll talk to you soon. Thanks yeah. for being here. Good to get your perspective today. Great.